Good afternoon, my name is Genevieve Renee, or Jen Ren, your favorite perfume consultant. Just here to share some advice with you today. The next time you spray perfume on your skin, on your wrist, please do not rub it like this. When you see a beautiful flower and it smells good, what do you do? Do you crush that flower? No, because you are destroying the flower, you're destroying the fragrance, you're destroying everything in it. What about when you're listening to music? If you just hear the percussions alone, yeah, it would sound good. If you hear the singing alone, yeah, it would sound good. If you hear the bass note alone, yeah. but you need to have all the notes coming together to give you that harmony, that symphony. So it's very important that you do not rub like this. You are breaking down the properties. You are sure that you don't care about the fragrance. Instead, let it dry naturally to the dry down. Now, if you're using one of our fragrances, one of FM's, you should see that oil concentration there on your wrist. Nothing is running down, all right? Mm, let it dry naturally. The first notes you'll get will be the top notes. Wait about five minutes or so, then you'll get the middle notes. Wait another five minutes and then you get the base notes. So that's how you know quality. Also, shake your bottle. And you see all those bubbles there that lets you know the amount of fragrance oil in it. And it's taking a while for those bubbles to dissipate. We could be here for about five minutes or so with me holding this up, but let me move on to the other part. So this just shows you that it will last longer. The corners still have the bubbles. Okay, the bubbles are still in the corner. So that will let you know again the quality of what you are purchasing. And I already showed you. So please, for future reference, do not, I beg of you, do not rub. Allow the transition from top note to middle note to base note. Allow the dry down. And then take a look at it and you'll see the oil shining on your skin. That shows you the oil concentration as well as, as, well as shaking the bottle. Because I'll tell you this, while some of them may have perfume written on the box, when you take a look at the ingredients, you realize that the first thing you see there is water. Whatever it has the most of, you'll see that there. So with ours, you'll see alcohol, then you'll see fragrance oil. I hope that this information would serve you well as you continue on your quest for beautiful fragrances and fantastic scents. As always, my name is Jen Ren, your favorite perfume consultant, here to add value to you and to give you a little bit of perfume education.